Good morning everyone. Welcome to Diamond All Crafting. I'm Christy and today what I have are cross stitch supplies that I got from AliExpress. I wanted to check out and see what they had to offer especially when it came to floss because floss is expensive now. Um, back when I started cross stitching a long time ago it was, floss was not that expensive but I think I can find it for maybe 60 cents at Hobby Lobby or Joann's. So I thought, well, that can get a little pricey if you're going to do a big project. And I do have some heaven and earth designs that I, I have bought that I want to do. So I got some floss and I got a few other things that I wanted to share with you. First, I'm going to ask how y'all doing. I hope everybody's good. It's Saturday morning here in the Southwest. Monsoon season. Um, so I wanted to get this video out before we lose power because that's always a possibility when those microbursts come through and your telephone poles get snapped like toothpicks, which we've had happen. Keeps it kind of interesting, but it also cools it way down. It uh, just gives us a heck of a lot of humidity. So let's get going on this. I'm going to tell you the stores I bought these things from and how much they cost. I've broken down the floss to tell you how much they are per skein. And I have not opened this other than to cut it. So let's get started. Let me move that out of the way. Okay. The first, oh, that's not good. The first thing that popped out are these little trays for your floss for your projects. These are only 30, 30 colors. So for a smaller project, these would work great. I have gotten a 50 that I'm using right now. Excuse the noise. I'm going to open one of them so we can take a peek. These I got from the Alley House Zone Store. They were $4.78 a piece. I've since I bought these, seen them other places for a lot cheaper. A couple bucks. They come with these great cards. They're kind of like a, you know, they're not paper. They're cardboard a little bit. And both sides are printed, so you can just slide it right on in here and mark your thread for the numbers or the symbols, whatever it may be. It'll hook over here, come through these little foam slits, keeps it all in place. Um, I noticed that with the kits, the floss is on those cards, which is great, except... I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but I get it so tangled up. This seems to keep it a lot um, more in place for me. So I really like these a lot. Hard plastic. I see some people have said that their little, what you know, sometimes their little thingies here, uh, they'll get it and one of them will be broken off. But it looks like these are all good. No break-offs here. So like I said, this was the... Alley House Zone Store, they were $4.78 a piece, and I really like these a lot. Really, really like these a lot. I think when I do a big project, I will pull out probably the floss I need for maybe 10 squares and do that at a time, because I'm, I'm trying to, instead of just randomly, on the project I'm working on now, it's a stamped kit. And I just kind of like stitch whatever I want. So I'm kind of all over the canvas. But I think for a big counted project, um, I'm going to start at one square and just do it square by square and see how that works. So anyway, those are really cute. And you need to give them a try. But I would search around. The store I got them at is a little bit, I think, too expensive compared to what I've seen other places. Okay. Let me see. Look at my scissors. Let's see what this one is. I don't want to cut the wrong thing. Okay. Oh, all right. These are our binder rings. I call them binder rings. The big silver rings. So that if you put your um, floss on, flo on drops or you put them in bags, then you can put them on these rings to organize them up, maybe as your storage, if you wanted to. That works pretty good, huh? If that's how you want to keep them in storage with like each 
a DMC floss grouping on a ring or even just do it by project. Um, I think I should have some plastic bags in here. Instead of buying, buying floss away bags, I ordered baggies off of AliExpress because they are just so much more cheaper, I guess you could say. These binder rings are good. And they there's uh, eight pieces in here, and they were $4.29. So if you go online and you go to Hobby Lobby, Joann's, Michael's, or whatever, or any of the stitchery stores, they're a lot more expensive than that. So I think this was a pretty good deal. And this was from a store called DZ Styles Store. Um, might find them a little bit cheaper in another store on AliExpress, but that just happens to be what I found. Okay, now this next one, let's see, what do we got? Okay. This I was looking forward to. This is floss, and what this is supposed to be is the new thread colors from DMC. But I got it. I think this is CXC thread, and it's 35 colors, two banded, and these are the new colors, I guess, from DMC. Oh, that one kind of came apart. And they're pastel. A lot of pastels, some deep, deeper purples, brown. Kind of a, a peach, I would say. Oh, sorry, my focus is not focusing. I'll move it up closer. As you, there's a like a purple fuchsia. There's a burgundy that's really pretty. Light green white and what they do is they give you the number that one says 19 this one says 01 see that on there man I don't know what's up with this focus okay so they're all numbered this is like a really pretty um, orangey like dreamsicle color. We always used to call them 50-50 bars. Really pretty yellows and kind of a light yellow, maybe a buttercup yellow. So these are pretty. They feel just like your average floss. I mean there's nothing different about it. They're cotton. It says cotton embroidery thread on it. These I bought with a, it has a brand name of MO, but with AliExpress, who knows? Um, these I bought at the Rhapsody Thread official store. They were nine dollars and ninety-four cents, which makes each skein twenty-eight cents. That's kind of a pretty tan color. Twenty-eight cents, still cheaper than sixty um, that I've been able to find. So. I thought that was a pretty good deal. It's nice to have these colors. Very pretty colors. Very pretty colors. What I need to do is go to the DMC site and check out their new releases and see how these match up. So I will be doing that. But in the meantime, um, that's what I found at the Rhapsody Thread official store. These stores have a ton of stuff. Um, what I find, I've been ordering from AliExpress for over 10 years. I used to have my own business. And what I find is that AliExpress is a massive mall with thousands of sellers. You need to check out the seller ratings and the seller reviews. If you're thinking about placing an order, you'll find there'll be gazillions of stores that sell exactly the same thing. Some ship faster than others. Some send better products than others. Um in some ways and they have good customer service so checking out the ratings on the store is really important before you uh, actually send them your money okay hmm. this is interesting oh uh, bobbins lots and lots of bobbins 
I think these are the cardboard bobbins. Let's see. No, these are the plastic bobbins. Plastic bobbins. And these I got from the Embellish Your Life store. I got, they were $2.16 for 100 So I got 400 here, maybe? Yeah, 100 in a bag. I got 400 here. They were $2.16 a bag. Um, huge, huge savings on that. Huge. Go look at the price of bobbins online, and you'll see what a, what a good price that was. So I thought, well, if I get all this floss, I want to be able to stick it on bobbins. Um, but then, I, then I'm thinking about how long that's going to take. So that was a good deal. Now this big one here... Oh, Lord. Okay, I'm thinking this one is all 447 colors of floss. Now, I think it's always a good idea. I'm working on a thing, like I said, now. Ran out of a color last night on a stamped kit. So... I thought, oh, well, I'll just rush down to Joanne's. And then I thought, no, wait. I'm going to do an unboxing video and open up all that floss I got, and I'll just dig it out of there. So, oh, wow, look at this. So we've got one, two, up, oh, little hair ties. Always use those. That was nice of them. That was like a little gift. Huh. A thank you note. Welcome to our shop. Hello, friend. Have a nice day. We appreciate your purchase from us. Hope you like our goods and leave five stars. Thank you very much. Best regards, Claire. Nice personal touch on that. May not be, you know, a, it's a printed out message, but the fact that I have been ordering from AliExpress forever, and that's the first time I think I ever got a thank you inside the actual package. Look at this. Look at these colors. Now, this is from the Al A. No, it's I. A I. Fash, F A S H, store. These cost $32.24 for all 447 colors of floss. That makes it about six cents a skein. Um, what did I end up getting charged? I think I got charged thirty six ninety eight, and I think that was with tax because they do charge tax. But wow, look at these colors! Oh, look at that! That's so pretty! Wow! If I hold them up like this. Look at all those flosses. Let's open one up. Yeah, that's easier said than done for me. Let's see. Let me get this in. Okay, here we go. Okay, these only have one band. Oh, these are super soft. They are way softer than the ones of uh, the new colors I just showed you. Wow. Now, it doesn't really, it doesn't have any branding or anything like that, really. If this is number 606. Sorry, my light's kind of glary. I have the curtains open, but it's overcast, so I'm not getting a lot of light in the room. But... This is some soft floss. This is really soft floss. Wow. Wow. For six cents a skein, how could you go wrong? I kind of looked around on AliExpress to find the best price because there's quite a few sellers that offer. Let's look at another color. That offer... Um, all 447 colors and I was looking at reviews 
to see what other people had to say and um, I, I went with this company because I liked the reviews they had a good rating oh that's a pretty pink look at that in this blue 336 Wow they just feel so good I don't want to put them down I like the quality on this I like the quality on this a lot what a pretty light lavender, purple not really lavender well maybe I don't know my floss numbers that's 211 443 I I can't help but recommend these colors um, I have some floss I've bought from 123 stitch for a couple kits patterns I bought so I'm gonna actually once I get this break broken down I'm gonna compare the colors and see how close they are to the DMC because boy I'm, I'm hoping that they're the same colors so keep your fingers crossed on that one Okay, we got one, one more little one here. Oh, okay. These are um, little pins. These are little dressmaker pins that I got because I've got some fabric I have to grid. And I thought these would come in handy. I've watched some videos on gridding fabric. I'm petrified to death to do it. These are little butterflies. Little butterfly pins. Let's see. Take one out. This is 100 pins for 74 cents. Let's see if I can get that up there. 100 pins for 74 cents. Now we'll see if any are broken or if any break along the way. I like the fact that they're so long. They'll definitely help me figure out my gridding on a 25 or 22 count fabric. Um, I think they'd be a big help. And for 74 cents, how can you go wrong with all of these? Pastelli colors, very pretty. Nice little hard plastic case to keep them in. Sorry. Stainless steel, so they're not going to rust. At least they shouldn't, anyway. They shouldn't. Okay, so those were all the things I got in that bag from AliExpress. I do have one other thing I want to show you because I just think he's just so stinking cute. Um... I got my husband, my husband, as tough as he might think he is, he absolutely cracks up over minions. Cracks up. Every single time a stupid commercial comes on, he cracks up over it. Um, and he just thinks they're funny. So I saw this and I thought, I can't resist. I got a little beaded embroidery kit for, um, minions a little minion guy and it comes on a keychain it's super cute I just have no idea how to put this guy together I was gonna tell you how much he was but now I can't find it he was four dollars and something cents he was not expensive at all let's take a look what comes with this kit I don't know why I can't find it. Let's see. Hold on just a second. I wanted to tell you, in case you're interested. Give me just a second. Sorry about the delay. Um, 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 um. it for you in just a second. Okay, <laughs> this guy's just so sweet. The Guai Guai store. It's G U A I space G U A I store. 
key was four dollars and sixty nine cents now it comes with the picture on what he's supposed to look like isn't he cute it comes with the chart and the little teeny legend on what colors you're supposed to use it shows you stitching examples down here but as far as assembly it's in Chinese so I'm kinda of thinking hmm well I sent them a text message uh, not a text message, a message on the AliExpress thing asking them do you have any instructions for assembly in English so let's see if they get back to me I like the fact it gives you the stuffing it gives you a little bag of the stuffing which is great we've got the canvas not super stiff but you know sturdy I would think it's a different feel than a cross stitch canvas but it's not plastic who knows maybe it is and I would think it would have to be to be a little bit tougher so here's the front of the little guy here's the back of the little guy from in looking at this picture I'm thinking I just have to cut an edge so that I can so whip stitch them together all the way around um, with the pattern we got threads in the colors so like with the blue beads you would use the dark blue thread and there's the light light blue the gold yellow and we've got like a copper maybe a black what is that this is kind of like silver and then we have a white along with the keychain we've got four needles in here one of them's really long and then the other ones they don't look quite as long but for all I know they are let's see maybe because the keychains in there yeah there's different sizes there's a long one and then three smaller ones so there's different size needles in this kit and then it has the little keychain and I'm thinking to attach this got a little chain I'm thinking I'm just gonna have to so 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 to get him to attach up here is at his head because there's I guess that would go in there I guess that's the only way to attach it so isn't that cute just use the same color threads because there are no instructions I can read the same color threads with the color beads I think that's pretty self-explanatory there's also some filament in here some plastic like fishing line filament in here and I don't know what that's for so I'm hoping if they send me instructions in English I'll be able to figure it out maybe this is for the exterior of attaching the front and the back together stuffing it with this stuff and I'm thinking maybe that's what it's for because it would be a lot stronger in keeping it together than probably thread would be so anyway I thought this was just precious this is just really cute and I wanted to show it to you so there you go that was the Guai Guai store I did also get some diamond paintings from them that I think are really cool but I'll show you that in another video. I hope you liked everything that I showed you today. If you have any questions at all about what we've unpackaged, I'm going to be listing down below all of the, um, the, the names of the stores that I bought this from in case you're interested in checking it out yourself. Please, if you do uh, go to AliExpress, please, it's so important to check the reviews check the ratings some I'm in Arizona some things I've gotten from AliExpress I've gotten in nine days others I'm waiting and it's been almost two months so I know that they all come by air in my experience I've never gotten anything from AliExpress and I'm that has come by ship so I think the delays at the ports haven't really affected what I've ordered anyway um, with diamond painting 
because I've gotten a lot of diamond paintings off AliExpress too. So um, just, you know, kind of read those reviews and check it out for yourself. I hope you liked this video. I'd like to thank all my subscribers for subscribing. And if you could please like and subscribe if you already haven't. I'm trying to build this channel up and I really, really appreciate all your support. So happy Saturday to you all. Have a great weekend and I'll see you soon. Bye.